He, uh, right, Samoa Joe, and we talked about that. The, um, yeah, with the no show. It. Yeah. But we, see, we had already, we had already been established, we had already established how good we was in Columbia. I, at that first show with the Dudleys and all that, mm -hmm. once we got the people in with them, I, truthfully, I don't think he had to book or say anybody was booked ever I, again. I, I mean, we I think they got really started. started they got a little well, starstruck with, with bringing in the names. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. because he's a mark. Yeah. Yeah. He's a big time mark. And I, hell, everybody starts out as a mark. But yeah. you you can't. First off, it ain't your money that you're using. <laughs> right. well, I mean, it, no, as it turned think, out, no, it I wasn't. Think, <laughs> I think that Benny and them should have been the ones who wanted, uh, who, who decided who came in and who didn't since it was their money that was being put up front. He, and I'm sure that they didn't get the money back. Just from what I remember, he didn't, he really didn't put up much of, much of a fuss. He just thought, you know, it was whoever I, I it's once we brought, okay. The first name I remember us bringing in, John, correct me on this. You might've been there though. It, Callie worked Buff Bagwell, correct? That's the first Buff name Bagwell. I remember. That, no, no. That was, I the, the, first, that was the night uh... before that was Tony Atlas and them. Yes. Tony oh, Ellis okay, came that's right. Rufio, yeah. Rufio Rush, Rufio Rush, uh, right. we, we ribbed him to go out there because he had to inter <laughs> interfere with the match. And we said, hey, if you don't if you don't stiff him, if you don't really lay in to Tony Atlas, he's going to no-sell you. <laughs> Rufio went out there, and Rufio gave him the damn biggest forearm. I think Rufio he was the lightest guy in the world. He the hell out of him. He gave him, and then, and he gave he him the Susan Green treatment. He got back to the back. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he said, "He said, damn, you, you didn't have to be so stiff." <laughs> so Rufio, Rufio hey, got you know, scared after I, that. I know, <laughs> I know a lot of people don't. I know a lot of people don't like Tony Atlas, but one thing oh, I can say him. about him is he sat what? at the monitor all night and watched the whole watched. show. I agree, and gave but I everybody you, who, that came back like to the Atlas? feedback. But why? Why don't people like Tony Atlas? I didn't. I, I didn't know nobody liked him. I didn't know. I mean, either. apparently, he, he like was, he was a standout like, guy. He, I mean, he was. Maybe they. Maybe they like him. They just talk shit about his feet fetish. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> uh, I don't know anything about that. <sighs> no, I, well, I, I wasn't. Either, e but, I uh, wasn't even <laughs> at that show because I had to. I had to work. I, I remember that was a show I I, I missed. Oh man. That, that was, was really, really. He was like a, yeah, it was, but he was a great guy. I mean, he was, yeah, hell, he, he would sit there and spend, he, he spent as much time as you wanted to feedback. spend. Yep. Yeah. Every guy, dude, sure he is. gave him feedback, whether they wanted to hear it or not, he gave it to him. That's the guy. It, it was good advice. Exactly. Yeah. That was the guys we should have kept. Like we had barbarian did the same thing with me one night. Um, oh Barb, yeah, I, I love, love Barb. Barb. Yeah. yeah, he uh, Barb loved me. He watched me he watched too. The monitor. Oh Johnny Blaze leg drop. Ah, oh, <laughs> we go. It's easy. We oh, go easy, Bubba. kid. Easy, easy, yeah. brother. Easy, easy, easy brother. Yeah, he said. I we didn't have a uh, a spot called for a chair, but after he seen that the crowd was really eating it up, hell, he <laughs> he, he he went under to me. First off, yeah, yeah. which I, I don't mean, think he liked at the beginning. He didn't like that fact that some, he, he was fine with it. 180 pound nothing's going to beat me. Well, yeah. once we got to working and I drank the beer from the, the belt guys at, in the front row, I stole their pitcher. He, he decided to take it upon himself to hit me in the back with a chair. <laughs> wow. And, and, it wasn't. It wasn't a steel chair. It was one of them damn plastic fold oh, up. Oh no! I, Which is worse? I think. I think they hurt worse than. Yeah, they, they hurt worse because it, it stings. They don't fold over you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so saw him at Fan Fest. Yeah. Oh, Bubba, you tell you tell Joe and Mary Sue, me and Terry, ready to come tag team. <laughs> he wanted. To, he wanted to take me to uh, South America or something with him. 
Really? Man, I just like you can yeah, get a I passport. Just, oh, don't. <laughs> it, that that would probably be a, yeah, that would probably be a big Don't uh No, no now. Duh. Don't get Well, I don't. could get a passport. I I ain't a felon yet. Probably now. I would trust Barb, but don't don't, don't don't get Mike Young. Oh no, no, Mike. Anything. Yeah, I was about to say uh, Mike <laughs> Youngblood. Yeah, if, it, if he would have had anything to do with it, uh, oh god, I wouldn't even thought about it. But Surprise. I think the can the show guy or the the it was I forgot it was what do they call them whenever you go over there on a tour? The tour got canceled uh, allegedly. <laughs> no, this is from Barb. I still no, oh no, I ain't oh Barb. Barb. Oh no, I thought yeah, I was going to say would. This Youngblood was, was involved. One. I doubt there was even a, even a tour to begin with, but that's that's another yeah, story. Yeah, I know. Poor old Adam Owens. And yeah, I feel Malachi bad for too. <laughs> oh, Malachi was yeah. one of them. Malachi too? got caught up in mm-hmm. that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mike Youngblood. He was at that CWA show, the first one in Columbia, wasn't he? Yeah, well, that wasn't he the was. first CWA show. That wasn't the first CWA uh, show, Columbia. I don't know if you remember, but they did one at a gymnastics place. Hammerick was yeah. on that show. Yeah, I was I was Hammer, there too. I yeah. I won the cruiserweight belt back from Xavier that night. <laughs> I remember you, Hammer you got was, the plate with you. He still got it. Do what? Where's the CWA plate? It's up here. The, the, oh. Oh, there you go. <laughs> see it? I see it. I see it. In I the see it. <laughs> and yeah, thank I, you, thank you, Magnum, because Mag he's the one that gave it to me. <laughs> yep. <I hear. laughs> I said I figured he was the one who deserved it. There you go. I did, and I thank I, you for I that. still had that, that belt when we when we went to your belts, Jason. Dude, oh, that, yeah. that that mm-hmm. me, that meant so much to me, and I thank you for that, man. I ain't no problem. Hell, I, I know that it was it uh, was I'm sitting just, over I'm there beside a couple of uh, trophies. I had to, I, had to I get think mine. I hugged you when you gave it to me. You did. You did, yeah. and that's that. That's that. That right there meant a lot coming from Blaze and Matt Blaze hugging. I'm surprised yeah. I didn't get a back chop instead. <laughs> you, pro- you probably you probably got that later that night. It, it's possible. You know, a lot of that kind of stuff is a blur too. But that, yeah, you know? but that match. I mean, I really. That was only my like second night commentating, I think, and nobody had smartened Which me up one to the, finish. Uh, when you and. Uh, John Blaise? had the ladder match, yeah, and no nobody had smartened me up to what the finish was, and uh, I mean I just called it. That's Roger and, working you. Well, I was generally excited to you know because I didn't know what the the finish was, and like I said, I I felt like that was I I I still go back to, to me that, that match. was the start the start that was of everything the start of of CWA like becoming because that was Buff Buff Bagwell was there that night. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I really and, think, I mean, was I think the crowd I think was most fucking people were at, huge. I think most people were there to see you and me do that ladder match. I do too. I, I, too. Mm. I do too. I did too because we we had or we was just starting to do the TV spot on Time Warner. Yep. Mm-hmm. But and, and so that and they was they was really building up for Buff coming, but uh, are the fuck oh uh, the uh yeah I about did it. That's all right. The uh. Mm-hmm. The the commercials that was on TV was me and you. Yes, mostly. I think that was the first winning the president on the poll <laughs> ordeal over Rufio. <laughs> <laughs> that was that was Xavier and Rufio. Yeah, yeah. I think that was wasn't yeah, that, that the was, first match we put oh, no, on that, TV? No, no, no. Never mind. That was no, Magnum no. and Rufio. It wasn't yeah, Magnum. Yeah, yeah, it was you. Yeah, it was you. And I won the president on toll. Yeah, right. I won. Yes, the president Yes, which on was the a pole. shot at, yep. at the cruiserweight yep. belt. Right. Yes, that was it. Okay. Because hey. y'all came to me. Long, long y'all came time to ago. me and told me. Y'all came to me that night before I worked Rufio and told me that y'all was gonna put the strap on me. And I said, yeah. I, I really didn't need it. Now I've got it. <laughs> I've got enough following. I mean, I, I didn't need a. I didn't need the strap. Cause I'm over. No, you. I was over here. You didn't. You didn't need it, but you needed it. Yeah. Yeah, and that's how that you was trying to. You was explaining that to me. Yeah. And I mean, I was. I, uh, I agree with you now that I look back. I mean, because you could do so much in building somebody else. Yep. And uh, you know, having the strap on your number one baby. I, yeah. I always and 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 look, you you did programs with Xavier. And then Malachi, yeah. and oh man, 
Yeah. You should. Yeah, we were trying it. to put you on the map, brother. <laughs> I I was well, always upset know, he never got the main strap. That was my bugaboo. That, that I did get it, but me. they took it from me the same day, same uh, like yeah. five seconds. Yeah, they later. took it like five minutes later. Yeah, or whatever it was. It wasn't even five minutes. It was five five seconds. seconds or... Damn baby doll. Yeah, yeah, that's uh, right. For interference in a ladder mm -hmm. match. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. In a, a ladder, yeah. <laughs> I didn't book it. That, that's, that's the part. That, <laughs> yeah, that, that, that was the part. I didn't book it. <laughs> and, and I hate to say it because I, I like I love Timber to death, but I, I think Timber might have had a lot to do with that. You should have had a run with the main belt because well, I wasn't even worried about the, the run. Oh, I know, it, it just, but no, it didn't have anything to do with the run. Timber could have won it back the next month. It was just something that the fans wanted. That's what I. That's the way I felt. If you're, yeah, and that's what you got to do. You got to give what the fans want. Yeah. So they keep coming back and spending that's their money. That's always been month. my method. Right. That's always been my method in my work in the ring. Is I try to hell. I listen to them more than I do to the other guy on the other side. That, that's what I mean. Yeah. If 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 that's something, and we all know they wanted it, even if we just did it for a, a couple of month program. You know, they were like, oh, well, those keep paying money because, man, we need to see Magnum get the thing back. You know, you, yeah, you got to yeah. give them, you can't give them the whole, the whole book, but you got to give them a couple little chapters to keep them, keep them coming back. That's, that's what, when I say book, I well, think I of it, I it, think of it like a book. Go ahead. I liked it in the day when there was only, what, three, three champions. It, well, four, it was tag, cruiserweight, and mm -hmm. heavyweight. Then they started adding yeah, then they all these other that Carolina championship in, right? Yeah, Lord knows. I, I was, I was that and a TV so when we didn't have TV. <laughs> it, yeah, exactly. And a, yeah, so why, and why a TV need, champion. Yeah. Why do you need so many titles? I mean, nobody's bringing their canned goods, rough house. Um, <laughs> <clears throat> He'll pop for that. <laughs> yeah, I figured he would, but he uh, Joe, 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 and them had. So many straps because Joe and Mary, Joe's just too nice of a guy, and too many people would be in his ear saying, "You know, I want to win the strap." He, yeah, he he had a lot of a lot of straps, and we and we didn't need them. Um, but I mean, CWA it should have been more of a, just about a heavyweight division. And then you got the cruiserweight division mm -hmm. and a tag division. And the a tag, tag division. Thing. That's all you yeah. needed, really. Yeah. It it makes it makes more sense that way. You don't have a thousand wrestlers like WWE does, where you have to have two different shows, and which which they tried to do in CWA. If you don't remember, I, yeah, I there, there was up. the there was the Jamil Temple, uh, all the workers that was at the Jamil Temple, and then they had the Orangeburg division. Yeah, they were trying to do a very, brand split, very just like way. just like WWE was, which I yeah, and, and I wasn't there. I wasn't there the for Columbia. all that. Yeah. They had me on the Columbia one. Yeah. And Which, and I love working Jamil. I love lucky. working the Jamil. I, I was but lucky. I was on the Orangeburg. <laughs> Orangeburg was just that was that was like my I, I would go into Walmart and get and get mugged. Or not mugged, yes, but mall. You're the mayor you're the mayor of that the town. <laughs> you would think. You could have ran in the damn well thing. You damn would it was, you damn sure would have got a high it, uh, it, polling. It made my my head get like this for a little while. I mean, I I'd be driving to the show and people would be coming up to me at the red light beside me and just yep. hollering, honking. Ah, and that that shows you the influence that CWA had in that town. You ain't like, kidding. Oh, I've I've got some stories about the police too. It's a it's a it's a <laughs> great. <laughs> It it was always a great wrestling town, and yeah. to take it as far as you know as we did, which which shocked me completely. Not only that there was, it was a great wrestling town, but there was that many white rednecks in in Orangeburg. <laughs> oh God! Hey, I mean, they this, weren't this, all, is, this is this hey, is the home of two white. black colleges. You know, right? No, oh, I know, I know. I agree with you. Yeah. <laughs> I, I agree, but there was a lot of white rednecks in there. Jason, you're about like, to flag Jason on YouTube. Yeah, you're about to give me a flag. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. It had nothing. I mean, it, but 
it's it's home of two black that's, colleges. Yeah, two that's not black yeah. colleges. That's not hate speech. He's he's right. It 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 has a it has a a, a large um, black population, and yeah, uh, and I don't know, and they would be at the shows too. And yeah, but but a lot of yeah, but there's a lot of how what do you call them? They're like a good old boys. There are a lot of good old boys in Man, I, too. I loved all the people that came to that show. They they, they, they like racing me, and they hunting made me and, good money yeah. for for good for for years they made me decent money and that and i gotta thank david garrett for that because if it wouldn't have been for david garrett going to bat for me i I would have still been getting paid 20 bucks to work for roger well i'll tell you this it wasn't just david it was us too yeah we believe that i believe that but i mean yeah well you know david would take a lot of credit on that but i love david to death i mean I, I, i can't i can't i can't i can't talk bad about david except his reffing but uh <laughs> <laughs> He'll know what I'm best ref, about. He was the best ref yeah. ever. What are you talking about? Yeah. Well, he he definitely he brought denim would, back. Would keep counting. He would definitely keep counting if if the shoulder he didn't think the shoulder got up. Yeah. Oh well. Malachi. I don't know if you guys remember this, but Hollow Wicked's first match was against Cali, and he didn't kick out soon enough. And he lost that match because David didn't stop counting. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, that that was the same thing with me and me and Micah. We had just started that feud, and we did like what we would call a house show at some. I, I don't remember if it was Blackville or it was at some high school gym that we did a, did a show, and I beat Malachi with a vertical suplex. Yeah, word. Because that sounds about right. <laughs> That's about, and yeah. and I looked over at David and I mean yeah I'm the winner but I'm I'm like this, what? Yeah. what what are you what are you what are you doing and I still gave him the 450 because I figured that's what the crowd would that's want. what the crowd wanted yeah. that was the right crowd. Dave was yeah. pissed because it made me look hellish it, well I'm gonna uh, say Dave and this is just me talking. Jason, I said this before on your show. Yeah. This is just me talking. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Yep. I think Dave, he wanted to look good. Even if he was a ref, he wanted to look good. But that's not a ref. And that, yeah. was, that was one of his problems. Because a ref shouldn't mean anything. A ref should be background. If yeah. Yes. He, if anything, he should, be ref- a, he should be dumb. And like uh, he should be... Re- well, I guess you. Well, not rain, a rain man. Spe- here, yeah. here from a from yeah. a f- from rain a former man. referee. Okay, a good referee, mm-hmm. you won't know he's there. A bad referee, yes. you're gonna notice everything, every blown yeah. thing that there, there is. is. And Great. you gotta and remember, the CWA. In he, my was opinion, to be, he was afraid. He was afraid to look bad. Yeah, Rusty. Rusty, yeah, Rusty. we should have got him on. And he Rusty's he would make referee. me. He would. He would make me laugh half the time. You mm-hmm. crazy yes. son of a bitch! You know he would, yes. he'd be like, "Oh, you're crazy, Hi. Are you are." Yeah, I, lo- I, lo- I love her. Nuts! Yeah. Oh, he was awesome. I went yeah. to his wedding. I was late for it, but I I, 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 I was there. <laughs> yeah, uh, the, we couldn't find the, we couldn't find the venue. <laughs> the I think the refs That's are cool. not there to get over. Uh, no, a referee. I think that was uh, David's. Yeah. David wanted to get over, it, and that's just my opinion. Like I said, yeah, it's a. It's, but, hey, hey, you're it's there. Possible. A referee is there to create the illusion of there's rules in this match, yeah. you know, and that's yes. and that's that's the simplicity of it. And um, oftentimes, if you have disrespecting. If if there was a worker that's disrespecting and and blatantly doing low blows and 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 stuff in front, I understand the ref stepping in and calling the match. Right, I mean that's disrespectful to the ref in the first place. I mean you can't you can't cheat with the ref staring straight at you. I mean they, it's right. You should school. know. You should know. Well, the referee should word. know when the boys are going to cheat anyway. Exactly, but you you got to let him know. Yeah. Well, well and the and, I, I just, and if they don't let the ref know, the ref should listen. Yeah, and and when it comes to cheating, you you do it the the old fashioned way. Really, is you make get the ref to look somewhere else, mm-hmm. which is so. I mean, it's it's stupid, but and it makes the ref look stupid as hell. But <coughs> it, it makes sense 
and the but fact it, that it's, you're, but you're it's not really get not qualified. Yeah, but it's really not that hard. And I've had so many places where I've been that that guys, and I'm not trying to put myself over here, but I mean, this is just so many guys that just wouldn't listen or wouldn't pay attention oh. to what's going on in the ring and think all you got to do is count to three or, or, or count to ten when the guy's on the outside. And I think that's all you have to do. And it's, there's a lot more to there's it than that. There's so much more to it than that. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, when I first got into this business, I, I'll never forget. I, I was working uh in jessup georgia it was my third show i had ever worked against adam owens and yeah it was just adam but we had grady Mm -hmm. grady was at at oscw he was at cwa for a little while i think yeah he was for some reason he didn't for some reason he didn't get over at cwa in which i don't understand why but didn't bring him in as much as he should have he He was the greatest you are yeah i know (laughs) (laughs) That's a good point, but 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 Grady Grady after after doing that match because I was I was still green to the business, but after that match he was sitting there telling me to open the fist and he was telling me to, and I'm like, what? I, I'm just punching. I didn't realize it was a rule that you ain't supposed to hit with your fist. In the I old mean, that's NWA, what the it would be doing. In the old NWA, that was a rule. Now people just throw punches, and there's no. I, you know, I, but no I was I was dumb to that. I grew up on WWF and not NWA, yeah. and you know. Yeah. Wow, that's hard to believe. You which, living in the south. Yeah. Exactly, but hell, it, it I was, was living on, up north, and I would grew NBC. up on NWA. Let me let me yeah, show you how. In, <laughs> let me tell you how old I am. Well, in Philly, right? y'all had everything. Let me show my yeah. age. When I was a ring boy. If you bought an NWA program, the NWA rules were printed right on the front the front cover. Yeah, I remember about, that. About uh about three counts and disqualifications yeah. and all that kind of yeah. stuff. It was right it was right. I there. Bought one it, at the it used to be twenty a twenty count outside ring too back in so, the day. Some right? promotions were twenty, yeah. And Puerto Rico was twenty. Yeah, I, I think I, it was I, Puerto I, Rico. I, yeah, so there were some places that were that did use the twenty count. I don't remember it in Mid Atlantic, but that's. that's hey, can I? Right when I first started about all this old stuff, can I? Can I say something else about Dave? Go ahead. Yeah, <laughs> yeah go ahead. Dave always uh, bragged about being the NWA light heavyweight champion at some point. Mm-hmm. Magnum, you heard this, right? I, I haven't. I don't believe. I okay. might have, and was but it, I, what, I was drunk a lot in them days. Remember that? Yeah, I mean, me too. Was it NWA? But, I know there was some like junior yes. title he talked about. Yeah, it was like an NWA junior heavyweight the title. Quackenba- the one that Quackenbush has had for the last 15 years. Yeah, but this is, be- this is before Quackenbush. Way well, before. This, this the was one, the Mike Jackson days, because Mike Jackson was also that. Day. Yeah, Mike Jackson. I was, or Denny, Denny Brown held it forever in the 80s. There was okay, a guy well, named Denny Brown. Well, yeah. Well, well, my point is, is there's no video, there's no pictures, there's no documentation. Like, I just think he was lying about all that. And I'm not sitting here just trying to bash David. Mm-hmm. But that's a thing. Like. Uh, that's a big deal. Yeah. It, it yeah. kind of is a big deal. <laughs> well, they came to me at NWA Charlotte about, about actually they wanting to put me over on Quackenbush for it, which oh, really? and then, wow. man, I got get oh I got gig I I got real giggy, I mean I was oh shit that's a big deal, yeah, yeah. I mean at least I yeah. thought so still. A uh, true wrestler, a true wrestler, or, or a true wrestling fan, anything that had to do with NWA, that, yeah. that meant a lot. That, yeah, was, that was one prestige. of my my very first. Match ever. I was about to say the F word too, just like you. Yeah. My very first match ever was at NWA New Jersey against Sabu and Tom Brandy doing the Patriot gimmick. Right. And that was my first show that. ever. And I was like <laughs> blown away. I was doing an NWA show. I oh, didn't no get doubt. paid. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I mean, a lot of the guy. I used to go down and do the. It was still uh, wild side back then, but I would do the Friday night shows. Oh, yeah. 
I mean, yeah, no, yeah. That, that was just me trying to practice. I mean, there's yeah. no, you know, you I went, I, I went door, down but, there I mean, a couple times. We didn't get paid. Yeah, we didn't get paid. Uh, me, me and Adam it, it used. To, well, me and Adam used to travel. We traveled everywhere. We went up to Chikara, and I mean, when when uh, Claudio, Claudio yeah. exactly. Yeah, this, Claudio yeah I was still snow. green. This is before CWA even started. But we yeah. went, we went down there to a uh, uh, Chikara. Uh, it was like a seminar. Claudio Castanoli. It was the first time he had ever came to America. He brought wow. him and some other Swede guy was there. Chris Hero was there. Both of the uh, Matt Strikers. <laughs> you know, the one who did Evan Bourne. The one who did Evan Bourne, he was one of them. Yeah. Oh, okay. And Seidel. Then Matt Striker. Yeah. Yeah. Matt yeah. So I'm Matt Seidel. Well, he went by. Did he go by Striker? Yeah. At that so, time. Oh, okay. Yeah, at that time. At that time, he did. Okay. I mean, but, yeah. dude, it got, I mean, it, all these guys that have eventually now are just huge in the business. The the real Hallow Wicked, no offense, Matt, but <laughs> yeah, you might have. He was in Jakar. No, there was, there was, was another guy. Jakar. Yeah. Jakar. Jakar. Yep. Yeah. He was, he was there. I mean, and he was a big deal down there. Yeah. Allentown, up Pennsylvania there. was like the, yeah, up there for you. Up there. Yeah. I know all about Al- it. Allentown, Allentown is like, yeah, the probably Ag Hall. In the world. It was probably Ag Hall. No, no, this was in the back of a, a, a wrestling store. I mean, it was just a store. Oh, RF <laughs> video, probably. That's oh yeah, might have been. It, it sold nothing but wrestling stuff in there, and I, I mean, I was, a, I marked out for that. Yeah. But I mean, it was no, in their their warehouse, like in the back of it. Yeah. Hey, it nobody, nobody would claim off, it was only this far off the ground. <laughs> That's how their ring is. Uh, no, nobody would claim to have titles they never won. No, right? I mean, I mean would they? Uh, how, <laughs> many, how many do you got, Jason? I, I, have, I, have the, I have the Texas Championship I won in Laredo a few weeks ago. Oh, no, no I'm kidding. I'm, wink, wink, hint, hint. That's right. That's right. In a, in a battle royal. You know, Foot, all mine footage, that I Footage bought, to come. No, I'm just... I had bought when I was in high school, or excuse me, my mom bought when I was in high school. I had the ECW television title, and I have no clue where it's at. RVD still yeah. got up. The original, yeah, he, he should, yeah. The original, yeah, but yeah. I'm talking about a, a gimmick belt that I bought. Some, I think it got in with the mix with T Money's stuff. I don't know how <laughs> how I didn't ever get it back. Well. Okay, Timothy Blackman, uh, the big go. Give him his belt back. Give him, get that man his belt. <laughs> I don't even know if he's got it, or he I, would, or he would. It would, I would see it at his shows, you know. I, I had did Malachi get mine a, back. Because <laughs> him and him and Billy, I'm still working for. <laughs> it's, it's a good possibility. <laughs> you ain't never seen that documentary for wrestling for Jesus. I have I not have seen it. it. I still have not seen it. I, I, I started watching it and fell asleep. Dude, that was on down. Netflix. Oh, my God. That, that is, yeah, that was back before Netflix was popular. <laughs> yeah. Because <laughs> they told me that. It was like, it's on Netflix. And I'm like, what's Netflix? It, it, it what's Netflix? Netflix? What's Netflix? Can I, what, what, channel, what channel on cable is that? <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> and, yo, they, they were in a bunch of film festivals, and they showed it at a film festival in Philly, and I went. I do remember I going to it. a bunch of film festivals. That was with T, T, or Tim's uh, second wife, because she was cool. I went to their uh, wedding reception and got really trashed. So wait, and nah, I'm, not you. Yeah. And I'm not, I'm not trashing, but yeah. what, was that the same documentary that had Chase on the cross and? Yeah, I remember. Sure. Oh Lord, have mercy. Okay, <laughs> yeah. Chase posted that, a pic that, on that Facebook was in the, the other day. Footage. That was in the bonus footage only on the DVD, though. See, that's uh, see, that's where I had to separate myself from like religious type <laughs> wrestling well, organizations. I, I, was, I was just from like, what I hear, I was seen on that on that the wrestling for Jesus. But I, I mean, I didn't have the were, speaking part. I remember too. him interviewing me. That, that was I remember him interviewing me for it. That was at the TWF thing. Because they interviewed me there and yeah. at the WFJ show. Yeah, do you, do you remember <laughs> the night that uh, Marty Janetti was 
doing a testimonial you in the room. You, you talking about when Bravo uh, 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 sold him some some uh, good stuff? <laughs> Columbia Bang Bang. And, uh, and he said, G he said, Jesus is going to keep me up all night. <laughs> and I bet it did. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. Me and Brandon Paradise was talking about that yesterday. Oh God, is he going to be all right with me leaving <laughs> yeah. that in? Oh my Jesus. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. He's oh, fine yeah. with it. <laughs> I, I called him Bravo. It's it's all good. Bra okay, Bravo. Yeah, we don't. Nobody knows who. Bra nobody, nobody knows who knows Bravo, who Bravo is. Bravo is. Yeah.